What's going on? Mike Newman here with Inside Natural Bodybuilding here at the conclusion of the IFPA Pro North American held in conjunction with the NAMBF Mr. and Miss Natural Minnesota. Huge show, over 230 competitors. The biggest show in Minnesota state history is taking place here in Bloomington, Minnesota. Great job, Aaron Kowser, putting on a great show, great venue, great sponsors, a lot of electricity in the air. Anyway, I'm standing here with Shannon Hagen, one of my favorites. I've seen her at a couple shows in the past. She's all over the place. She always does well no matter where she goes. Shannon, how do you feel you did? I feel like I did great. Yeah. I, well, feel, I feel great. <laughs> I mean, well, for one, you, you have placed, what place did you get in that master's class? Um, I got third. Third place, and you're placed in the top five in, the, in a tough open short class. I mean, that's one of the tougher open short classes I've seen. Uh, and you placed in the top five in a tough open short class, and then you placed in the top three in your master's class. And those master's competitors can sometimes be tougher than the open competitors, can, don't, wouldn't you say? I believe so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because a lot of the girls that I see winning these shows are always around 38, 39, 40, 42 years old. So I think it's, a lot of it has to do with the muscle maturity, wouldn't you say? Or what do you think about that? Um, I also think that we're more disciplined. Yeah. You know, I am 42, and I want to work harder for it. Yeah. And my kids are older now, so it's the it's the age for, it's it's our time. It's 40-year-old's time. Okay, why do you think that is? Because you think the clock's ticking. I'm in my prime right now. i got a few years left in me, so let's make these few years count. Because when you're in your 20s, you think you got all the time in the world. Is that what you're thinking? Or why do you you think you train harder? I think I train harder because I am older and I see my competition and yeah. and I want to be just as good as these 30 year olds so, okay, so that's, what, that's part of what drives you then I'm very competitive yeah now I see you at so many shows throughout the year you're not always competing sometimes just in attendance but how far do you allow yourself to get from stage weight throughout the year in your off season um, about 10 pounds okay so you're always within striking distance then absolutely and I watch the body fat you know I try to get a, a good 17 percent fat yeah for me works okay well I think a big reason why you placed in the top five in such a tough open short class was because you must have had a productive off season did you allow yourself very few cheat meals or something in the off season or how'd your off season go well, um, I can tell you I concentrated on very specific body parts that the last judges told me to work on. Yeah. And so if my coach tells me to do something, I do it. I didn't cheat very much at all. I need to do that more often. I'm human. Yeah. So I think I'm going to add in some cheat meals for this next time. Oh yeah, how would that benefit you? I think I'll get bigger. Okay, you want to put on some more size then. That's what so I want to be bigger. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, that's a plus. I like a girl that's not too afraid to get too much size on her frame, that's for sure. And you could use some size. Do some quarter turns for the YouTube land people out here. Here's what a 42-year-old top master's level competitor looks like here. Go do some quarter turns, Shannon. And she also did well in the open. And this open is open for anybody age 18 to uh, as old as you can. And she hangs in there. And it was, I think it was a stacked lineup. I don't know how many girls were in that class. There were a lot, though. And she placed in the top five with a lot of girls that were even half her age. So... So, Shannon, how's that feel? I mean, when you're competing against girls half your age and beating them, what kind of feeling is that? It's amazing. Yeah, I would only imagine so. Yeah. And what's your what's your uh, what's your advice out there for people to stay strict? Because a lot of times it's, it's tempting to cheat on your diet, but you said you were so disciplined with it. Do you just talk yourself out of it, or what's your advice for people that have a hard time sticking to it? Um, oh gosh. I mean, how do you stay so disciplined all the time? I mean, you want the cheat meal, but you just don't talk yourself into it. How do you hold yourself back from having that cheat meal? This is so much better than a cheat meal taste. Yeah. It's not worth it to me. I'm like I said, I'm very competitive, and I, you know, you can, you can track the food all you want. You can hide those cheat meals all you want, but it shows here. I gotcha. And I will not cheat. Everybody would like to look great, but not everybody was willing to do what it takes to look great. But Shannon Hagen here, she's willing to do what it takes. But she might give herself some more cheat meals, but you earned it, though. But here we are at the NAMBF Mr. Miss Minnesota. Shannon Hagen, she plays in the top five in the open division. Be able to look up her in the future. Until next time, you guys got to get some Jenks production. If you guys are promoters out there promoting the show, you got to get some video footage done. You got to go to Jenks Productions. This guy is the man. He does work for Dana Maney in the Badger Classic. He's working for Aaron Callister here at the biggest show in Minnesota State history so you can't go wrong with Jenks Productions if you guys need video footage done of your show until next time bodybuilding fans Shannon Hagen I'm Mike Newman you're watching Inside Natural Bodybuilding we're out of here